Thank you for watching this vlog. How are you? Hi. I hope Ashley is going to be here. Ashley, I'm doing this for you. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Heather. How are you? Hi. Lola Sana. Lola Sana. Is it your enemy? Oh, hi Ash! Ash is here, so okay, we can get started. Okay, good. Alright, so I think I have some tips for this. Hi Eric Kun, how are you? Hi! Okay, so anyway, alright, let's see. When I started Lola Asana, that was like two years ago? I couldn't do it. I just couldn't do it. I had to do with I had to do with blocks. Yeah. So let's let's just use block first. But before we even do that, I want you to do little exercise to just activate your core. Okay? Activate your core. That's really important. It's not just, you know, you're working, you know, on your arms, right here, on this, really low down there, you know, just, just do Navasana and just kind of hold, then tuck in, tuck in really, you know, really hard, because, you know, you want to be high up, and if you can just hold it, you can, I mean, you know, so you have to be really tuck in. Okay? Alright, let's see. Tuck in first. Yeah, like, really tuck in. Now, if you could do that, you know, really tuck into chest. Right here, and your banda is working really hard. Okay, like this. And I, I actually did something really funny thing. I just wanted to try something weird. <laughs> this is like a cheating, but let's just <laughs> cheating. But let's see. I just wanted to do, like, you know, I wanted to feel how it's gonna be, you know? So let's see, like, like this. Knee and chest together. Knee and chest together. This is cheating, but, you know, you, you just wanna feel how it's gonna be. Tied it up. Blocks. You wanna feel it, you know, if, you can tuck in really, really tight. <laughs> then pick up. It's really easy though because, you know. Ah, so light. So light. So light. And as you can see, I'm using my head. As you can see, I'm using my head to put the butt up. Okay, hold on. Here, straight arms and using my head. Okay. It's really important you tuck in. You really tuck in and bandas. Squeeze. Squeezing bandas. Squeezing, I'm really squeezing right now. Okay, all right. So, bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Yeah. Tuck in. Squeeze your bundles. So, actually, 
Both pose is really good. You can activate your core before you do that. Okay? So now, I have two blocks. And Navasana, both poles, you think you're gonna be tired, right? No. You are now squeezing your bandhas. Then do it, hit you the head. Man, so you know, you have a little space. I mean, if you have like a really strong arm, you can just pick it up. But I'm leaning forward. Yeah. And let's see. There's another exercise. Both poles. Push. Find your index finger knuckle. Push. Okay. Maybe you can just round your back like this. Head close to knee. Okay. And you just find the blocks. You just find the blocks right here. This is good for jump back though. This is good for jump back. Like push, lift, and jump back. You have to find blocks, you know, with your toe. You have to find your blocks. Activate your core. Tuck in really tight. Maybe head a little bit down. Push. Find your blocks. And jump back. Arm really, really slowly. This will work later. So now, let's see. How, how high I can go. <laughs> Tucking. Dee, 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 tight. <sighs> I'm, I'm gonna just use the floor. If you have a carpet, get rid of it. Because on the carpet, it's, it's really hard. You need a hard floor. And you might want to think about your legs too. If you have like a long feet or something, touching them, you know. So maybe do this way or, you know, it depends on, you know. But let's see. I usually just cross. And as soon as my head is going down, I'll just be cross. Okay? Okay, pick it up, be cross. I can do this way too though. So, arm is not completely straight. Uh. But, lean forward. I mean, if just here, I mean, you can't go anywhere. If, if you lock elbow, you can do anything. So I, I, I use this technique for my jump back too. Push and bend. Bend slowly. It, it's kind of the same thing. Push. And bend slowly like this. And jump back. Have to do with um, breathing. Inhale, pick it up. <sighs> Exhale, jump back. Oh, just pick it up. I know, I know. Just fast. Fast. 
move. I know, I know. For the um, primary, we do Navasana and pick up. We do Navasana, pick up. Five times, right? Well, changing legs, but you know, five times. That's really good, good exercise. So I used to do Navasana, cross legs, pick it up. Navasana, cross legs, pick it up. All the time. And all of a sudden, after this, this game, after pick up, you know, kind of swing. After pick it up, swing. Yes. Right, so just try pick up first. And if you start to kind of get used to swing. Yes, then today I talked to Ashley about this, but um, when I was, uh, well, I couldn't figure it out how to jump back. I used this too. Like pick it up, swing, and hook my one foot, light foot, then jump back. I did that for a long time. I just, did you see that, my, my foot? Hook, yes. But you have to be lean forward, as you can see. So that's a good lesson. Pick up, lean forward, and hook. Then jump back. That was really good. Yes, for a while. You can do that way. And if you, if you do it really quickly, it's like you're already jumping back. <laughs> quickly. Like, pick it up. You know what I mean? Yeah, but it's, <laughs> it's like two, two different you know, movements. It's like a cheating, but... But I mean, it helps because I know I have to going forward to, you know, put my butt up. So now, with breathing, you can jump back from there. Yes, forward. But it's, I know it's really, I know it's really scary, you know, when you just go forward. It's just really scary. I mean, this way, you know? I know it's really scary, but if you're using core, you won't feel much weight. See, I have a little thin arm. Okay, so the lowest one is just like that. Then I just use that move for my um, jump back. So, have to be with breathing. Okay. So, I think leg tuck in is very, very important. Very, very important. Let, let it tuck in. Okay? And it's, it, that's okay if you can just pick up. Just for a while you can do this. Pick up. Pick up. And if once you get used to it, lean forward. Lean forward. Being full, okay, and then you know your wrist will be strong too. You know you need a strong wrist to do this. Mm. Oh, Heather, Heather, I have, I have one little, one little thing for you, Heather. My uh, up dog, my up dog. Um, I have a friend. She used to be ballerina. She knows how to move her, you know, body really well. 
And she told me about um, up dog. My up dog used to be horrible because I only care about my knees not touching on the mat. So I always, I always just going down and thinking about not touching my knee. So just like that. See, I can, I can, I can only go here. This is like a max because my shoulder blades, my shoulders blades up have to be like dandasana down. Not up, <laughs> down. So, so I have to. Don't worry about touching me or anything. She told me. So, like, when you go down, right here, I have to sit up. My shoulder blade down here. Shoulder blade down here, so I can go a little bit more. Right here, I have to put my shoulder breast down, then go like dandasana, dandasana, not, <laughs> the shoulder was way up here, you can bend, but if it's dandasana, chest up and back bend, so, she cued, going four and down, right here. I, I'm putting my shoulder blades down right here. And to me, it doesn't look good, not yet, but to me that was a big, big thing. I feel like I'm bending my back. So anyway. Do you have any questions? I'm sweating right now. You think you think much better? Oh that's good. That's good. Okay. So the Lolasna? Just pick up and lean forward. <laughs> pick up and lean forward. Then see, 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 my arms are a little bit bent. Not locking. Uh, hi, Gretchen, how are you? Yeah, lean forward. Okay, one more time now. I'm sweating right now. Lean forward. Squeeze, tuck in. And leg, you can do either way. But whichever. So tuck in. Tuck in, squeezing. Pick up and lean forward. Now. So thank you so much. Thank you for watching. Bye. Bye bye.